where I'm pleased to present uh, uh, the director, Simon Aboud, and the producer, Christine Alderson, for the film This Beautiful Fantastic. So, Simon, well, first of all, welcome to our web TV emission. Some of our, our viewers won't have had the chance to actually have seen the film yet, and therefore this is an opportunity for you, in effect, to give it a little pitch. So maybe you could just give us a brief scenario of uh, what the film is about. Uh, the film is basically about a young woman uh, called Bella Brown, who uh, is desperate to her lifelong ambition is to write a children's book. She's abandoned as a child, and as a result of that, she is agoraphobic, she has obsessive compulsive disorder, and she finds herself at the age of 27 trapped in this small basement flat in London. Because she never goes out, there is a garden that's a very neglected garden that's in, in which nothing is alive. And she finds herself suddenly in this position where if she doesn't fix the garden, uh, she's going to be chucked out, evicted from her flat, which is the only place of safety she has in the world. And because of this, she's suddenly thrown together with three very unlikely people. One is this cantankerous, horrible old neighbor, Alfie, who is the opposite of her. He, he treasures everything in the garden, but doesn't like human beings. Um, his housekeeper and general sort of slave, Vernon, um, who is a great kind of nourisher, he, he likes to feed people metaphorically and, and physically. And finally, a slightly mad inventor called Billy. And suddenly, these three people come into her life, and she begins this uh, slightly magical adventure which. Uh, sets her off into life. Well, you set the scene with the characters, but uh, I understand this film was a long time in the, in, in the gestation because of the, the, the cast that you've managed to put together with it, this film. Uh, you've got Tom Wilkinson playing Al Alfie, yeah. you've got Andrew Scott playing Vernon, and of course Jessica playing Bella. I mean, she shines in this film. Uh, how did you manage to actually get the, the cast together uh, in, in the end? We never really had a problem attracting uh, attracting people to it. What we had a problem was attracting financiers, um, and we were just incredibly lucky with 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 all of the roles. Actually, your cinematographer on this film, the film looks fantastic. Um, yeah. I don't know the work of your cinematographer. You worked with it uh, for. Or? I, I knew Mike through a film that's been here, the film Claire Barnard's film, The Selfish Giant, which I thought was an extraordinary film. And this is not your first film, and talking about those film connections, uh, you did uh, Comes a Right Day, I think, yeah. with, with Craig Roberts, who was here last year with yes. his film. Yes, uh, just Jim. Christine, uh, you've got a connection with the film festival vaguely as well, yeah. in the sense that I think you did... Uh, what was it called? Snow in Paradise? Snow in Paradise was yes. here two years ago. Yeah. yeah. Did you come and Soul with Boy was here, I think, eight yeah. years ago. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes, Andrew was uh, Andrew Holm, uh, the director. Yes. Yeah. Very kindly buying me drinks in the bar. Oh, but you didn't make it uh, along to the festival that particular year. I did make it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I did. So this is not your first. It's time not my in first there. in Dinar. It's my fourth time in Dinar. But um, so, I love Dinar. It's a fantastic festival. So thank you very much for coming Thanks, today, Tom. and uh, <laughs> all the best. Thank you for talking. Thank you, Keith.